Okay, so this is under Stonekeep, and this is where you'll be getting the dwarf and metal ingots. The first thing you have to do is go up here and talk to this guard. He will tell you that you need to get permission to enter the museum. And when you do that, just uh, head back down these stairs and go straight across. You're gonna go have you're gonna have to go and see the court wizard to get access to it, and you will have to do a quest. I have my quest to uh, gain his trust. Okay, so just talk to him. Make sure you wait until you have to kill some type of spider. Okay, so just talk to him, and then head up this path right here, open to the open uh, into these doors. Okay, so this is just them. Um, uh, a quick uh, um, a fast forward of the area on how to get to the spider, it's just really simple, it's just down here. Uh, the spider is pretty big so you might have a, a bit of a struggle fighting it, but it's pretty, it's easy enough anyway. Okay so go up these stairs and talk to Aletheus, and he, you will get a quest of him to find the books I think it, that's what it is, and then when, once you've done that, uh, head through these doors. Okay, so this place can be really confusing, so you should do the quests in order of the way they come up. So disable any other quest you have uh, for a notification, and then just do these. It takes a while, and you will find a lot of uh, Dwemer um, metal objects in here. So you're probably going to have to make two or three trips to get to get most of it. I had uh, my companion with me, so I could get most of it. Okay, so head back to the arch, uh, the court mage, and return the quest. He'll give you permission to enter the museum. You can even st you can even steal these uh, these uh, parts here if you want it. Okay, so once you've done that, if you're gonna do it, uh, head back past the entrance and up into the museum, which is up the top of these stairs. Okay, so this is the museum. Uh, this is this has a lot of uh, Dwemer metal pieces in here. Um, you will have to hide uh, and steal them, but the guards won't attack you. But just by being in here, which they would have done if you didn't, um, if you didn't do the spider killing quest. Okay, so you will have to open some display cases and everything to get the full amount out of this, and don't get to bring your companion so you can give to her. Or him, um, a couple of items to hold as well. That's what the, that's the best thing to do. So you can probably get all of it in one or two trips. Just keep on checking around for everything. And it would probably be best to save it every now and then. Okay, so this uh, this gate, this door here, has um, a good few pieces in it, but I think the lock is expert, so you want to make sure you have enough lock picks. Okay, so once you've looted all the pieces that you think will be enough for yourself, um, head to any forge or blacksmith. Um, I'm just going to use this one here because it's closer, so you can see it's just at the end of the, at the end of the pathway there. So you can see that it's all there, the amount of pieces you get, and everything like that. Okay, so just smelt um, everything there. Make sure to take them off your companion if you gave her some. Okay, so once you've done with the smelting, um, you should head to any blacksmith, so you can get iron ore. 
so you can smelt it to bars or you can just buy the iron bar straight away. Okay, so we head to a blacksmith. But first, you'd, before you do that, you'd probably want to make sure you have the skills. You will definitely need at least 30 smitten for it. Okay, so purchase steel um, smitten perk and then purchase dwarven smitten perk. So you should start creating dwarven bows. That's what the whole the guide is all about. Okay, so the best thing about these bows is that you can sell them for 95 each or higher depending on your spellcraft level. Okay, so sell these to all the blacksmiths and merchants and anything you can if you have a lot of them that is. I had 97 at one stage and it took me ages to sell them. No. I know 170 of them at one stage and it took ages to sell them. So make sure you know exactly where you're going. Okay, so once you've sold to that one or whichever blacksmith you are, just keep on traveling to all the cities until you've gotten rid of most of them or enough at one stage so you can just sell them off every now and then. Okay, so I'll be heading to Riften first, and then White Run, and I'll fast forward the rest of this. Okay, so I found them another spot you can get some Dwelmer, Dwelmer um, pieces. It's uh, just on the map where I showed you there and it's up in this place called the Dwarven Storeroom. It has a lot of stuff in it. Okay, so I think this, is, I think this was um, an expert level lock and you can see that like, these are, all these shelves are just full of stuff. Thanks for watching the video and be sure to subscribe and if you know any more places where we can find a lot of uh, Dwemner uh, loot, uh, please leave it in the comments so the rest of us can benefit from it. Thanks and see ya.